Good afternoon, students and parents. This is Mr. Ian here again. And very shortly, I'm going to be reading one of my poems that I've appropriately selected for this week. But before I do begin, I just want to say a massive thank you to our school community for making this first week of remote learning a huge success. The work, the efforts, the communication, collaboration between students, parents and teachers has just been phenomenal. And I cannot wait to begin next week and really, really continue to work together in getting through this very challenging period together. So today I've had a good look online and tried to find the most appropriate poem. And I found one called When the World Turned Upside Down. And it's a poem by Margaret A. Savage. I do apologize because I'm gonna read this from my computer screen. So if I do lose eye contact for a short while, I do apologize. When the World Turned Upside Down by Margaret A. Savage. The day when the world turned upside down, when a frown became a smile and a smile became a frown. When the mice chased the cats, the cats chased the dogs. The dogs laughed out loud at the pink and yellow frogs. When you went to bed in the daytime and got up at night, when the birds caught the school bus and the cows took flight. When the moon came out in the middle of the day and all of the ocean's fish rolled around in the hay. When the children ruled the world and ice cream was free and the elephants shrank to the size of a flea. When the grass rained lollipops up to the sky when you wanted to laugh but could only cry. When magic beans were real and giants very small, you would eat spiders' legs so you could creep up the wall. This all happened when the world turned upside down after I went to bed with a smile, not a frown. Thank you so much once again. Please reflect with your families this weekend and I wish you all the best health, happiness. We're in this together, GFS. We can do this. Goodbye.